once again I embark on yet another gastronomic journey. This time at an authentic, rustic bistro. Yes, I'm at the Olive Bistro here in Mumbai at the Oberoi Mall, Goringa East. Soups, salads, mains, risottos, desserts and a lot more is what is served here all day. And I'm looking forward to an exciting, leisurely lunch. So do come along with me. in the Olive Bistro menu. It was a confusing task to decide what I should eat. But of course, Chef has made it simple with his recommendation. A beetroot salad, a seafood risotto and an insanity cake slice is what I'm having for my afternoon lunch at the Olive Bistro today. So I'm ready to tuck into my beetroot salad. Apart from the beetroot of course, it's the goat cheese always that attracts me to this salad. I can never resist it. Green meat. Nothing pairs better with the beetroot spice than goat cheese and of course orange slices, arugula leaves and a tangy mimosa dressing. Simple. medley of textures and flavors. Soft, creamy, goat cheese mousse, crunchy and yet soft beetroot slices, absolutely crunchy and fresh arugula leaves and of course the right amount of zest and tanginess with the mimosa dressing. This salad is absolutely the perfect palate pleaser. After having relished my beetroot salad, I'm on my mains. Yes, an Italian risotto is what I opted for, courtesy chef's recommendation, and I think it's a great choice. I love the presentation of this risotto. The reddish tomato risotto, of course, lots of seafood. I can see calamari, prawns, and river sole. It looks really appetizing. Succulent pieces of calamari. Although I'm quite full having had my beetroot salad and thoroughly enjoyed my seafood risotto, I can never resist a dessert. I think most of us can't. And this insanity cake slice of this spoil looks more of indulgence than insanity. The top layer is a red currant mousse. The middle one, an orange flavoured white chocolate. That truly really sounds interesting. And of course, the lower one is the sinful, decadent dark chocolate. Exciting presentation can make anybody who even does not like desserts hungry. Let's try it. I must say, the orange flavoured white chocolate surprisingly is the layer that gets my vote. Chocolate of course is always exciting and interesting. Red currant exciting too. But I think white chocolate flavoured with orange is really unusual and unique. And I think Chef has done a great job on this. My lunch at the Olive Bistro has truly surpassed my expectations. Great variety, amazing presentations, and of course, the ingredients were absolutely fresh. I thoroughly enjoyed my lunch. If you really want to come and enjoy a leisurely lunch, or perhaps even a dinner, I think Olive Bistro is really the place to be. If you enjoy watching my food reviews, do subscribe to these food channels. At least, Uttapams, dosas. I'm here at Movinpik Juhu, the first and only outlet.